Hollywood has taken over the small west Otago town of Tapa Nui. Robert Redford is among the actors who have arrived to remake the Disney film Pete's Dragon. Dave Goosling reports. Back to life for Tapa Nui's former sawmill more than five years after it was shut down. It's a key location for the movie Pete's Dragon, a remake of the Disney classic starring Robert Redford, Bryce Dallas Howard and Carl Urban. We've gone out of our way to really not be a big impact on the town. Of course, we will be some impact, but they have embraced it. I think we bring a lot of business to town as well. Along with scenes at the mill, the film will also be shooting in the main street of Tapa Nui. And that taste of Hollywood has residents excited. We didn't expect this to be coming to a small town, especially like Tapa Nui. Crews are busy remodelling many of the town's stores, transforming the main street into 1980s Oregon. Most of the makeovers are temporary, but a few businesses are hoping to keep their slice of American pie. It's actually looking pretty good and we're liking the way it looks now, so we're hoping we can actually keep some of it. Business is continuing as normal for the town's 750 residents, although cafes are doing well, helping to feed some of the 300 strong cast and crew. But with no hotels in the small township, some residents have offered to move out of their homes for the duration of the shoot. I spread the word, people put on Facebook and the phone was ringing and um, we now have 87 houses we're renting privately between Gore and Tapanui. Filming wraps in Invercargill later this month. Post-production to add Pete's computer-generated dragon will be done by Weta Digital in Wellington with the movie due in cinemas next August. Dave Gooslink, 3 News.